Online Business Mastery, video number 14. Getting Bound with SEO. Remembering SEO for business websites provides a wide range of benefits. Let's find out the do's and don'ts of an SEO strategy for your business. Search engine optimization defined. Essentially, SEO is a practice that involves the improvement of a website to increase search engine ranking results. The search engines such as Google and Bing deliver targeted traffic to websites and make sure your site's content appeals to your audience is highly relevant. Online Marketing SEO The major search engines use algorithms to locate appropriate web pages when people enter search terms in the search box. These algorithms attempt to locate pages that are close or exact matches for users, search terms, or keywords. Fire your Black Hat SEO agency. Black Hat is a term that marketers have used for years to describe shady SEO practices. These are techniques designed with the sole intent to manipulate search engines, Google and Bing, to rank a business by spamming the internet. Google doesn't like these practices and they'll ding you for it. Key Elements of SEO The team responsible for SEO at Google is the Search Quality Team, a group established more than five years ago to ensure the best possible user experience. The goal of this team is to ensure that key signals of quality websites align with what's shown on search engine result pages. Number 1. Manual and Algorithmic Evaluation Google incorporates a manual and algorithmic approach to reviewing web pages. This two-fold approach is designed to ensure that quality always triumphs. Number two, evaluation procedures are continuously improving. Through a series of updates nicknamed Panda and Penguin, Google has made aggressive leaps forward in ensuring quality. Number three, focus on big picture themes that influence SEO. These include, number one, indications of quality subject matter expertise, backlinks, content depth, social media signals, internal linking structure. Number two, strong user experience, short page load times, sitemaps, original content. Number three, authority, backlinks, longevity, site age. Number four, submit a sitemap. A sitemap is a list of pages on your website. This tool will help ensure that search engines know about all the web pages on your site. You can also create your sitemap manually via RSS feeds that update with new website content and text files that you will need to update on your own. Number 5. Webmaster Tools Both Google and Bing have Webmaster Tools platform. It is a resource that can help you see how search engines are reading your website. Build an SEO strategy from scratch. Here's what you do when you're just starting out. Number one, start a PPC campaign. You can always use tools like Word Tracker to figure out which keywords to go after. But very soon, you'll realize that you need more revenue data. PPC campaigns bridge that gap. Number two, start building links. Do not fixate on anchor text. The expression that is hyperlinked, this approach is actually quite spammy. Focus instead on directing links to highly relevant pieces of content. You find relevant links from the website that are already ranking from your main keywords. Number three, create a Facebook fan page. A strong Facebook presence can help generate viral exposure for your content. Number four, focus on PR. Hire a reputable ROI-focused firm. Work with a consultant or deploy your own internal team. Your PR agency should focus on number one, launches. Number two, news. Number three, guest posts. Number four, interviews. Number five, prioritize conversion optimization. Make sure that you focus on conversion optimization. By optimizing your website for conversion, you'll develop a steady revenue stream. SEO and user experience should always be aligned. Focus on the technical components of SEO in addition to the strategic components. Think of SEO as a strategy for communicating information to search engines. Thank you for watching.
and we'll see you in the next video.